Welcome back to Video Pro Vlogger channel. Like what you just saw in the video. In today's video, we will be showing you a different kind of looping scrolling text animation background effect. And it is not difficult to achieve this effect. I will divide the entire editing process into several episodes and explain to you in details. And I hope you can join me to finish creating the effect. Without further ado, let's dive in the first video. For the first step, you lead to free download of software through the link we put in the description box down below. Then, open VideoPro Vlogger. Create a new project. First, we find this icon. Click on it to open the resolution panel. Check the customer video resolution box. Then, adjust the white value to the maximum and height value to the minimum. Change your background color to white. When finish it, click on Done to apply the adjustment. Then, find the Titles icon at the top left. Open the panel. Select the title preset you want to work with. Drag it to the subtitle track. Now, we come to the inspector on the right. First, add the text content. It is suggest to present words in a horizontal and a space layout. This makes it easier to do the following edit. Then choose a the font you want. Adjust the size of it. Then find the add text button. Click on it to enter the advanced editing page. In the custom panel on the right, scroll down and find the text color area. Click on the little color box. Select the preferred color. Then uncheck the text border. This will give us a solid text effect. Click apply to return to the main interface. Now, we need to make another hollow text. Just use the shortcut Ctrl C to copy it and paste it in the back. In Inspector, click the Edit Text button to enter the advanced editing page. Similarly, we come to the text color area. We first click on the little color box. Copy this color number using Ctrl C. Then change the color to white. Click on Done. Now take the text border again. Click on the color box. Paste the number in the value field with Ctrl V. This can give us a desired result. Back to main interface. Find the camera icon at the top of the preview window. We move the playhead to each of these two texts. Click on the icon to create a solid text bar image and a hollow text bar image. Now we're done with this part. Now we drag the two text bar image into the software. Click on the icon again. Change the resolution here to 16 to line. Delete the two texts on the track. Then click on the plus icon on the far left of the overlay track to add a new track. Drag the solid text and the hollow text to the two overlay tracks in turn. Select the solid text first. Find Show or High Layer Rectangle icon at the bottom of the preview window. Click it. Adjust the rotation, size, and the position of the text bar. Of course, you can also go to the Transform area in Inspector 
to make more detailed adjustment for these parameters. Once we're done, let's edit the hollow text bar. And you will end up with this look. Now, let's add motions to each of the two texts to get them scrolling. First, select the text bar. Click on the motion icon to enter the motion editor panel. Then, find first keyframe. Click on add keyframe. You can adjust the frame directly here. Or you can also adjust parameters to control your frame. After editing, drag the playhead to the last frame. Click Add Keyframe again. Move the frame to the very right. Let's check the result. Very nice. Here we note down the parameters of the first keyframe. This will make it easier to add a motion of the hollow text bar later. Click Apply to return to the main interface. Next, select the hollow text. Click on motion icon. Again, we click add keyframe in the first frame and fill in the values we just loaded here. Then add a keyframe to the last frame. Move the frame to the far right. And we are done. Now, Let's add two more overlay tracks. Copy and paste the two scrolling text bars that we have made below. Adjust their positions in turn. And now we have this effect. Alright, this is all for today's video. And in our next video, we'll show you how to change the color of the scrolling text bar. Anyway, be sure to click that subscribe button to subscribe channel if you haven't yet. And we'll see you soon in our next video. Hope you enjoy. Bye-bye!